Luciano thrived on his reputation as the biggest racketeer and the most eligible bachelor in Manhattan. Every time he would walk into a room, I'd get like butterflies in my stomach. It was like a sexual attraction. But Lucky paid the price for his notoriety when a crusading gangbuster named Thomas E. Dewey sent him off to prison. Behind bars, Lucky not only kept his position as chairman of the mob, but came to the aid of his beloved United States during World War II, greasing the way for U.S. troops invading his native Sicily. After the war, the gangster who loved America was forced to leave it behind. But Lucky would then prove that the mob, like other big businesses, was not troubled by national borders. Lucky could run a racket anywhere, and did.